In this video we're going to show you how to build a balsa wood rubber band powered plane. We'll give it a few flights and show you how to adjust the wing to get it to fly straight. Okay, we'll need to punch out the parts for the plane here. Here is the elevator. See, it just punches out there already cut. Here is the rudder. And here is the cockpit. There's your pieces ready to go. Okay, we're ready to start putting the plane together. Here's all the pieces we punched out. Here's the elevator. It slides into the slot in the back of the few slots just like this. Sometimes it's a little tight, but it'll go in. Now we'll take the rudder. Slips in the slot on top of it right here. And the canopy or cockpit, it'll go in the front on top or right here. And now your wing. Your wing slides into the slot on the side just like this. Be careful you don't break it. It's very fragile. Slip it right through. Get it right in the middle. Slide it on in. Right there. And here's your propeller. It slips right on the front of the fuselage, right here. Takes a little air, it goes, now it's in. Take your rubber band, it fits in that little hook on front of the plane right there, and on the back of the plane right there. There's your plane, it's ready to go. We'll make a few test flights here in just a minute and see how it does. To wind up your propeller clock counterclockwise, just like this. Wind it up until you get the rubber band tight and it'll be ready to fly. When you let it go, you'll see how it does. We'll need to move the wing back on this one because you see it climbs too fast and stalls. You can see we slid the wing back just a little too far on this one because it dives too much. So slide it back to the forward just a little. Okay, you can see it still dives a little bit too much. So slide it forward just a little. Looks like we got it too far forward because it's stalling. Adjust it back just a little. Looks like we got the wing where it needs to be because you're going to see some good flights right here.